Ah, oh, you've got to love that new box smell. Hello there, dear viewer. Today I'm talking about the latest Second Sight 4K release. It's High Tension, one of the bloodiest, goriest films that I've probably ever seen. And it has this fantastic limited edition set, which I'm going to show you everything that you get inside. Before I get talking about this, there are some links in the description of this video if you want to purchase this. It helps support the channel at no additional cost to you. And I'll include links for the limited edition and also the standard 4K version. First of all, if you've not heard of this film, this is from 2003. It's a French horror movie, sometimes known as Switchblade Romance, from director Alexandre Aja. The basic gist of the film, these two young girls who are best friends go and stay with one of their families for the weekend. But of course, there is a killer on the loose. We see lots of people getting murdered in some very grisly ways, some of the most extreme stuff that I've ever seen. And we follow the main character, Alex, as she tries to survive this ordeal and save her best friend. It's a very simple format, one that we've seen in the horror genre over and over again, but it's the way that the film is executed, the style, and just how it looks and how it appears, is truly unique to this film. It obviously borrows a lot from films like The Texas Chainsaw Massacre, but then again, so do so many modern horror films. But interestingly, the story in High Tension goes into some places that I was not expecting, and it left me thinking about the film long after I had watched it. So how does the High Tension 4K from Second Sight Films actually look on your screens? Well, I'm here to say it looks very, very good. The film was shot on 35 millimeter film, so it has a natural film look to it. All of the grain is there on the image. There's no scrubbing, at least to my eye. So it looks natural and it looks like a film, which is very pleasing to me because the cinematography in this film is actually quite outstanding. That's one of the things that really stood out to me. The combination of the direction and the cinematography, I think really took this film to another level where if it didn't have those excellent elements, it could have been perhaps lost to history. The addition of the HDR 10 plus grade really does help the image, particularly because a lot of the film is quite dark you know it's a horror film so to create atmosphere and to also hide budgetary constraints a lot of these films will shoot in darkness and that is where a 4k disc with the addition of hdr can really benefit the film not only that but the colors in the film look beautiful and it's weird to say beautiful because a lot of it is very bloody but the blood looks good. The film also sounds perfect to my ears. There's a DTS 5.1 track on here. So no complaints for me in regards to video and audio. Second Sight have really knocked it out of the park with this one. It's a great release to kick off the year along with Mean Streets. Uh, what I would say about this film is it is a horror film. It's a slasher film, part of the French extremity movement. So look, if you're not into slashers and very gory, graphic, bloody films, then clearly this is not for you. And I have to say that historically, this is not the sort of thing that I have been into, but it's through films like High Tension and some others that I've watched in recent years that I'm starting to acknowledge the artistry in these films and not just see them as superfluous, you know, gratuitous gore fests. So you will know if this is your kind of film. If it is, then it is definitely worth getting. I give it my full recommendation. Now that we've talked about the picture and the audio, let's have a look at what you get in this limited edition. First of all, the box. I love the new artwork. I love how the spine looks and the back as well. Very minimal, very clean. This is what Second Sight do. And we've come to expect this level of quality. Inside the box, we get a few different things. As always, we get some art cards. Some of these are the new artwork commissioned for the release. Some of them are stills from the film. Then we have the case, which holds the film and it shows the killer looking very kind of Michael Myers, leather face-ish. Really annoyingly, I've already banged this somehow. So there's a little mark up at the top. So annoying, but look, I will live. Inside the case, you get the Blu-ray disc and the 4K disc. Both of them have the exact same content, so you don't have to switch to the Blu-ray just to get the special features. And then we have another great booklet from Second Sight Films. Runs at just over 60 pages. There are four essays and lots of notes 
on the production of the film and the cast and crew information. I always say this, but the quality of the Second Sight film's booklets are always, you know, some of the best in the industry. And I always look forward to reading them straight after watching the film. So those are my thoughts on the high tension 4K edition from Second Sight Films. Another stunning release from Second Sight. Such a high level of quality and I just hope that they continue to keep it up. If you'd like more 4K recommendations and reviews from me, then just click the video that's presented on screen right now. Thanks very much for watching and I'll see you soon.